In this video, I will share with you the auto dilution pre treatment function of Nexera LC40 series with optimized method parameter settings. This is the overview of this video. I will start off with the comparison between manual and automated dilution, then move on to the auto dilution pre treatment parameter settings in Nexera LC40 series, and finally, the auto dilution performance evaluation by linearity and repeatability results. When conducting quantitative analysis by HPLC, dilution of standards and samples is performed manually. Working standards for calibration are prepared by a serial dilution from stock standard solution. Manual dilution not only requires some degree of experience and knowledge, it also takes time and effort and more prone to human error. Automating this dilution-related task has a very positive impact on efficiency and productivity. The Nexera LC40 Auto Sampler incorporates such pretreatment functionality as a standard feature, allowing dilution to be fully automated. These are the Nexera Auto Sampler pretreatment functions. Together with Lab Solutions Graphical User Interface offers simple operation as it eliminates the need for complicated programming of pretreatment methods. Compared to manual dilution, in auto dilution, the stock standard solution is simply placed in the auto sample rack. To do the auto dilution parameter settings, in instrument parameters window, click auto sampler tab. Set the rinse volume to 1000 microliter for each injection. Then click pretreatment and select dilution mode from the drop down list. In the dilution mode window, specify the valve contains stock solutions to be diluted. Then specify the valve that contains diluent. Next, set the total volume of the mixed solution after dilution. Setting range is 100 to 1000 microliter. And then set the dilution factor and the setting range is 2 to 100. Set the number of mixing cycles here. Mixing is performed while aspirating and dispensing the mixed solution through the needle. 4 is set for homogeneous mixing. Set the volume to be aspirated and dispensed for each mixing cycle. Setting range is 1 to 95 microliter. Select whether to perform bubbling by discharging air through the needle during dilution. Use is selected. Set the wait time after the completion of pretreatment. This image shows the SIL 40 CXR auto sampler and the valve's position. Polypropylene valves and 1.5 ml valve metal plate are recommended to use for the stability and improved mixing performance during the automated dilution. To do the dilution parameter setting, first click Edit Instrument Parameters. Under the Auto Sampler tab, click Rinse Settings. Change the rinse volume to 1000 microliter. Then click pretreatment. Select dilution mode from the drop down list. Specify the valve number of st stock standard solution. Specify the diluent valve number. Set the total volume to 120 microliter and set the dilution factor. Change the mixing count to 4 for homogeneous mixing and the mixing volume is set to 30 microliter. Use is selected for mixing upper air and the wait time is set to 1 minute. Click download and close and finally save the method. Key in the method file name, then click Save. That's all for the dilution parameter setting. After registering the batch sequence, then the SIL 40CXR auto sampler will start the pretreatment. During the pretreatment, needle aspirated the diluent, 
corresponding to the set dilution ratio. Then dispense into an empty polypropylene valve. Needle move to the drain position, lower and dispense rinsing solvent at the set volume and speed. Then move to the rinse pot for external rinsing. Needle aspirated the stock standard solution and dispense into the polypropylene valve. Needle move to the drain and rinse pot for rinsing. Final volume was set to 120 microliter. Mixing was conducted four times with mixing volume set to 30 microliter. After rinsing, needle returned to the injection port for injection. The whole process took three minutes only. Here I introduce an example of the analysis of caffeine and methylparabine using the auto-dilution pretreatment function. The figure shows the overlay chromatogram of the auto-diluted standards 1 to 10, diluted from 200 ppm stock standard solution, with the dilution factor is 2 to 100. A calibration curves of 10 standards with concentration range from 2 to 100 ppm was established using the auto-dilution mode. Excellent linearity was achieved with R square greater than 0.999 for caffeine and methylparabine. The reproducibility of the auto dilution function was evaluated by triplicate pretreatments were carried out with the percent RSD of retention times, peak areas, and concentrations of caffeine and methylparabine all achieved 1% and lower. We are coming to the end of this video. In summary, a fully automated dilution of two mixed standards, caffeine and metaparabine, was set up on Nexera LC40XR. Using the dilution mode of SIL40CXR autosampler, a fast and automated 2 to 100 times dilution was established for quantitative analysis. Good linearity with R square values 0.999 and above was achieved for the calibration curves. The percent RSD of retention times, peak areas and concentrations of the three injections of each concentration level achieve 1% or lower. The automated dilution method for two mixed standards was found to be stable and reproducible. Thank you for your attention. Excellence in Science, Shimazu.